Okay. How do... So I need to end up there. Which... First things first, combat. I, I said combat. There we go. Check out my parallel turn. I don't know what that means. I'm only fighting one Pokemon, so Draco Meteor. Are you a Dragon type by any chance? No, but it doesn't matter. Boss Esteban. No, you wipe me out. Yep. Uh... There we go, now I can fight you. I know Price is secret. Yeah? And what's that? The Botanist Mia. My wood hammer, call my name. Is this enough to beat you? Yes, yes it is. Now, I don't suppose you're weak to this. I know it's very unlikely, but... Yeah, I'm just gonna swap out. <laughs> get my, uh... Get my stats back and whatnot. And that's the only reason I was swapping out. Not just because, uh... I know how bad I am about, you know, hurting myself. <sighs> Alright. It's fine. Power whip. You're kidding me. It's very unlikely he will use Teacher Dance for a third time, right? Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay. It's fine. <laughs> Why? I'm already confused. Do you only know Teeter Dance in Cross Shop? Is that what's happening here? Get crit on. Nice. March a little bit up. Alright. Fighting Beldum, let's swap back up to Balboa. Alright. Drake a Meteor. Please don't miss. Oh no, this is gonna hurt so bad. Anyway, Magnet Bomb. Mm. 
noise. What's your secret? What's Price's secret? Whatever. The reason Price is strong, it's because every day he sits on top of very cold ice and trains his body and spirit. Sure. I believe you. Anyway. Uh, I'm assuming I don't have a PP up, right? That would have been in the medicine category. I think so. Maybe I have a berry that does it? What are the name of those berries? Nope. All right. I honestly want to be at full power. I want to see if I can get some XP for Balboa here. And as such, I'm leaving once again. Well, Espeon isn't the best, like, defensive Pokemon, a Rock Seal type, unless I get hit with a Fighting type move, is really tanky. I resist so many things. Yes, I Fighting type moves are fairly common, but, you know, there are ways around everything. So, if I could, you know, stat up myself a bunch, then I should be good. Uh, to remember how I did it last time. Down here, over here, around, up. And then over. There we go. All right, let's see if it was even worth healing or if this thing's just gonna one-shot me. Cool trainer female pie? I see. Well, normally I'd be terrified of this thing, but I have no idea what moves it knows, so. Acupressure, Jeffrey Dahmer. Hop, 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 hop. I should have been terrified of it. Aw, oh, she just got hammer fisted! I don't know why I swapped out to you. I knew I shouldn't swap out to you. Whatever. I literally just got through with a Pokemon who is four times weak. I don't need to swap to another. Alright, uh... Would this have been good against you? I don't know. Slaking. Can I paralyze you? Nope. I can no longer escape. That's fine by me. I wasn't trying to. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Okay, could have been worse. Could have been worse. 26. Of course you don't have a freaking Hyper Potion. Do I get a stat up from this one at least? No, why would it? Stab or crit. Either one would work here. Well, I finally got a stat up on the last one. Cool. You're sending in a diglet. Dig a dig, dig a dig. 
Uh, Shadow Claw. Get caught. And now, let's see what you are. Hmm, you're quite the trainer. Shadow Claw. Not a psychic or a ghost. Alright, uh, Flash Cannon. I'm starting to think this thing actually doesn't have anything that can hurt me. What was my middle name? What was flexible and not easily broken? I'm not giving up yet. Get crit on. It seems as if my luck has run out. I mean, you did face me. Alright. So it wasn't even worth healing before this, as, you know. Bobo didn't get anything, but it's fine. Professor Elm, huh? Okay, now that I think about it. This is the point where it wants me to listen to the radio. Um, I'm testing, testing one, two, three. We're the amazing Team Rocket. It's been three years since we rebuilt the team and restructured. Uh, Proud to announce that we are back. Giovanni, can you hear this? We finally did it. Let's go to Goldenrod. I think this is contrived, to be honest. Yeah, the, the idea that, oh, hey, you can't come in here because you're not wearing the uniform. I'm like, okay. Have you thought that maybe I could just, like, beat you up? That's what I do with every other Team Rocket grunt who I see. All right. Clothing time. This guy just changed me. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Alright. But now that we're in Team Rocket gear, let's go. Yeah, I'm not allowed to continue wearing this. And I've been changed once again. Krim, why? <laughs> why do you do this to me? I almost made it through without even having to battle. Whatever, free XP. Magna Bomb. And again. Another one. That's actually very clever. Um... I didn't actually have the Pokewalker myself. I had my sister's like hand me down thing, so I borrowed her Pokewalker occasionally and played with it. 
but we lived out in the middle of nowhere, so I wasn't really allowed to go walking around the countryside. So I instead just kind of ran up and down our driveway repeatedly. It was fun. That's what I get for living on a farm. That's fair, yeah. Imagine trying to sneak into a place and some guy just goes, You're not really them. Go fight them like a man. And I'm like, If you're not going to help, then leave. Yeah, that's absolutely fair. Honestly, this is one of my, if not my favorite Pokemon game. It, it is my favorite mainline Pokemon game, I'll say. It was just an improvement over gold and silver and crystal in almost every way. It is just fun, it's charming, the music's great, there are so many cool features to it. It was just great. My favorite Pokemon games probably the Colosseum and XD games, just because they're so different. But, you know, that's just me. Yeah. Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald are all great, as are Omega Ruby, Alpha Sapphire. I I thought they were great. I wish they had included the Emerald content, because if they had, I think they would have been near perfect. Magnum Bomb. That sucks for you. <laughs> Two damage from a Hyper Beam? <laughs> Uh. Hey, that is a good ad then. <laughs> Completely fair, to be honest. Honestly, all the evolutions are near and dear to my heart. Um, the only issue I have with Leafeon is that it's shiny isn't like full colored. It's just off green, which is kind of lame. You're kidding me, one eight. Uh, whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Completely fair. Black and white were great. Um, how I view it is this, the best original generation, like the one that did the most to change everything up and wasn't like a like re-release or whatever, was probably Black and White. There were so many good things about it between Black and White and Black and White 2. The best re-release was probably this game right here. I think that it just did so many cool things, it just improved upon it in just about every way. Emerald, Ruby, Sapphire, Omega Ruby, Alpha Sapphire, those are near and dear to my heart, but they're also the games I played when I was like 10, and also then Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire when I was like, I don't know, 20? I don't really remember when they came out. And so, having nostalgia, but I think that they were an amazing change to form over the original Gen 1 and 2s. Um, and I love Coliseum and XD because they were made by a company other than the Pokemon company, and, you know, I think they just did things so differently. I wish Pokemon could be slightly more adult, you know? But they'll never do it. <laughs> so, you know. Yeah. That's absolutely fair. I... I've only ever actually played through Chrono Trigger once. Um, like, from start to finish. And it was so many years ago. 
but I still listen to the music from time to time because it's just it's just awesome. You're kidding me. So That would normally have hurt a lot, but thank you for going out. Licky licky. Uh let's go with Togepi. I mean, to be fair. Oh, Dark Void, right, yeah. Um Sorry. Random yawn. Yeah, I'm using the emulator. I used to try to stream these games just, like, on console, but I had major issues with my console, and this is a randomizer, so trying to get a, like, custom cart for it would have been a pain, so. I just play an emulator for the most part. Oh. Well, this thing's a ghost type, so... Um, personally, I use Melon DS, but there's not a huge difference in most of the emulators. They will have, like, slight differences on which one, like, which ones have strengths. Um, you can use Desmume, you can use Melon DS, No Cash GBA is fairly good. They all are pretty solid with high compatibility. Um, sometimes some of them have, like, online features versus, like, some enhancement things. I think that Melon DS is probably why I'd recommend to most people, but Desmume has a couple things that Melon DS doesn't. So, you know, typically one of those two. You can also use RetroArch if you want an all-in-one kind of experience because they have cores for other things, so. Yep. No Cast GBA was my jam forever. What a Chad. Okay. Uh, realistically, I'm actually gonna go and grab the items from the uh, department store because I haven't yet. That's actually pretty cool. Um, I know that you can actually adjust the screen spacing on Mo and DS, and if multiple of the other emulators also let you do it. That way you can essentially emulate that. Ugh. For some reason I have like, I think I have a hair in my eye or something. Eh. Slight irritations. Alright, I think this was the department store? Yep. Alright, what has my mom been spending my money on? Berries, of course. A moonstone. That's actually something I needed. Thanks, mom. Berries, of course. Alright, my mom did a good thing, I guess. The Moonstone. Finally, Jiggle. You are no longer Jiggle. What are you? Yep. 
You're a grand bull, which... Really, that's not... the best, but it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Are you still the same type? You're a poison dragon. Okay, that has some good uses. Weak to psychic and ground, I think, but otherwise... So, psychic, ground, dragon, ice, but resist most other things. Alright, that's fine. I can see that, yeah, but one nice thing about it is that it did allow for some creative different uses. And not every game had to use the full screen sizes. They could have used the 4x3 for both of them if they really wanted to. It just allowed for other forms where this was like the lower screen, the add-on screen was like a menu for the most part. And then the other one would be your visuals. Um, some games still use the lower screen some, for some of the visuals while having like, you know, the upper screen for different menus or like, you know, features that are currently active in game. It really depends on what game you're playing, though. For the Pokemon games specifically, it just allowed for a better resolution up top, while having the bottom one be, you know, just a menu, which is fine. It's pretty much what these games did. Got it. That is absolutely fair. But, once again, you could still have it that way. You could have had the upper screen be, like, anything the lower screen being your main screen to play on the upper screen being like the upper area above you so that you'd have you know a better view of everything there are still ways to get it to work and it's why you can play canvas curse on the 3ds it's just it wasn't as intuitive for people to develop i guess all right i actually want to fight you Okay. I do not remember what Lugia is. I don't think I've seen Lugia since the first stream. Ooh. That's not good. That's not good at all. Alright, we're swapping. Three HP. Yeah. Whenever there are any limitations in any game, people will make the most of it and find cool ways around it. But the moment anything is like, oh, hey, this is how it is, people just stick to it and aren't creative. And that's the issue. Like, with the N64, when they were developing Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask and games like those, there were so many limitations, but some of our favorite features of those things were based on the limitations. You know, having the different mask things, it's because you couldn't have regular transformations, so they had to make regular items. They could, you know, the three-day cycles, everything was based on them saying, oh, this is the limitations, so how do we get around this? And then the 3DS, you know, the DS had this limitation where these are the two different screens, so, oh, hey, we can play with it in these cool, creative ways. The moment that limitation is no longer there is the moment they don't think that way. So. Yeah. Correct. I never actually got into the... Like, it's not that I never got into them. I never really played very many of the games that held the DS like a book. There were very few ones that I actually ever played like that. A good example of a weird thing that they did was uh, the Pokemon that... No, it wasn't the Pokemon. Which game was that? There was... A... I don't remember which game it was. Um, you essentially had to copy, like, a stamp over, and you did this by closing the DS and then reopening it, because you were essentially pushing the two screens together. Was it, like, a latent or... What was it? I'm forgetting which game that was now, actually. It's just a cool thing that you could only do with, you know, a DS. Because they had the two screens that you'd close together. There are a lot of games that just were super creative, and I kind of miss those, to be honest. Uh... Okay, so Resist Steel... I don't 
really know what that means, so ancient power. Brodora, how are you? Don't you dare. Oh. We shall be excited to see her. Apparently I'm just beating up Team Rocket for the fun of it, and no other reason. It's mainly for the XP. <laughs> Get crit on. Hello, Adora. Welcome, welcome. What is Rapid Ash? I fought one earlier this stream. Swap over to you to get you the XP. Also, I got a Balboa. This is my Espeon. Oh, no, it has Arena Trap. That sucks. No, I've not got a single Legendary. But I got an Evolution, and that's what matters. I really doubt it, but Draco Meteor. Close Vanessa Gar. <laughs> Well, there went Balboa. Gotta love Arena Trap. It's my favorite, and by favorite, I mean I hate it so much. Really? <coughs> Just a second. My throat was just being bleh. Whatever. Um, Marsha shall, shall go up here. You sent me the good stuff? Thank you. I appreciate the good stuff. TM. Gent Kim. Ah, oh, it's just a little baby. Hi, baby. All right, I'll swap off. Well. I may well end up using that, but it wouldn't be this stream, probably. Mainly because I don't want to have to set up and stop what I'm doing. But I appreciate nonetheless.
And just a little baby. Hi, baby. Use facade. That's another Down Eevee. Hyper Bang. Move that sounds way better than it actually is. Why, why do I have to suffer through this? Meowth, help me. Meowth the spy, obviously. Just sneak by all these rocket losers. Champion Bob. Get crit on me. What am I, an idiot for changing to a Pokemon that was, you know, was neutral? Ow! Judgment Day. Air Slash! That one really hurt. Uh... I know you're not a ground type, and that is literally all I know. One HP! Okay, you are a grass water, if I remember right. Which sucks for what I have left. That's my assumption, at least. So, Judgment Day, if I'm faster than you. Not proving to be faster than a lot of things right now. Nope, you're not water. And you cannot miss with Aerial Ace. I meant steel water, not grass water. Maybe it was grass water. Maybe that's why I said it. Power whip.
What are you? You know, I'm finally using this full restore. God, you're frustrating. Uh, Shadow Claw. Zigzagoon. Oh, maybe it was a water rock type. That would make sense. That's why it was neutral for the electricity. Well. Let's see. Resist. And I'm poisoned. You're the worst. True, the German sausage. Are you a rock type, maybe? Nope, you also resist. You're a steel type. That makes sense. Honestly, this is very fitting for a rocket battle, because this is just a pain in my rear end. Infernape. This will probably go poorly. What do we think this is, guys? Best odds, this. Let's do it. Resisted it. Of course it did. Why wouldn't it? And poison. And that's that battle. You're wasting my time like this. Why? Well. Now that we've shown how awful these guys are. Because, man, I hate them. Let's see if anything good is on sale right now. Uh... Oh, this is all that stuff. I was looking for... The regular sales. Which is none of these. I'm not going to go searching... Wait, no, I think it might have been the counter over on the left here. There isn't a counter on the left. Never mind, I'm wrong. Just... I'm going to go to a different store rather than go up every floor trying to figure this out. Make sure there's nothing on the first floor. No. Okay, goodbye. I can finally buy Ultra Bowls. So, right off the bat, I'm buying 10 of those. Uh, I can buy potions, as well as revives. 
Okay, let's buy... 10 of those. I'm going to need... 10 of these. And those. There we go. Now that I've spent all my money. Let's go beat up Team Rocket. Give a big stretch and let's go. Just on speed up for now. You're a flying type. Good to know. Goodbye. Uh, if you are a flying type, I'm going to set out Manny. In Torchic's defense, it is technically a bird. Judgment Day. wants to learn Rock Tomb, which has too old of an accuracy, I do not care. Chair is aired. I'm actually going to use Balboa for this one, because I know it's weak against Steel type. That could be bad. Let's see if I get a crit. Nope. Just gonna keep on growing. I'm fine with that. You're definitely not showing it off. Bone meringue. How dare you fate cry at me? Get crit on. Alright, uh, Piplop. I don't know what Piplop is, so I'm swapping out. Well, with my special defense being so lowered. Okay, Magnabomb. Any chance you're weak to this too? Nope. Ow. Well. Of uh, course. Of course. Yeah. Of course. Well, no, you know that. Um. Togepi. Dark Pulse. Crit 
Piccadilly. Uh, let's see if you can handle this or no. Get crit on. How do you miss? That's not good. Um, let's swap off. With a low kick. Goodbye. Alright. So everyone here knows that Altair is obviously a normal. To it's a ghost type. Comedy. Alright. Well, it's a ghost type, so Dark Pulse. Yeah, Mom, you're spending my money that I'm beating up Team Rocket for? Thanks. Alright. I'm gonna go heal up my Pokemon once again. I know it's slow and steady and whatnot, but... That was the incorrect building. Yeah, that is pretty typical actually. Oh, that's not going to do a huge amount. <laughs> All right. Get crit on. Wait, what did that say? Whatever. Did it say it has levitate or something? Trick room. Okay.
Yeah, that was on me. I did that in the incredibly wrong order. Okay. Fly away now. Trick room more off. Sucks to be you. Dialga, God of Time. Uh, yeah. What's up? What's up, buddy? You're like a steel type or something, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Realistically, I'm just gonna pop a uh, super potion. Dusk Noir. Okay, so this could be bad, depending on what this is. Yeah, it's not good. You're not a grass type, you're probably not a bug type, which means I'm swapping. Togepi has a decent chance. Okay. Dark Pulse. Could be a Dark type. Alright, could be a Dark type. Is not a Dark type. What resists Dark that isn't. It has to be a dual type. Because. It resists dark, but isn't dark type. It could be. It has to be like a dark mix of something, or like a steel mix of something that's weak to. Yeah, there are only a few things it could be. All right. Uh, we'll kick again, I guess. Like a steel rock type would fit that, I guess. No, I guess not Steel Rock type, because it would have been weak to Bone Meringue. I don't know. Hey there, buddy. Oh, I can no longer escape. Get crit on, though. 
Hey, reading is overrated. I'm just saying. That was a lot smoother than it was previously. Yeah, I mean... That's not good. I forgot it had Psywave. Oh, it's not super effective. Why is that not super effective? You missed, idiot. And he tried to sing to me. Sing with me, sing for the year, sing for the love, and sing for the tears. I don't remember what Infernape was. I'm assuming no one else does, so I'm not gonna, gonna bother asking. Bone Meringue, what's it get? Arrow Blast, I mean, that's neutral. Didn't matter! Ow! Okay, hey, Manny, I'm gonna send you out. Judgment Day! Yeah, if it dealt that much damage, that had to be a flying type. <laughs> In my opinion. Uh, Zigzagoon, I don't have any idea what you are. Oh? Oh, thank you for the follow. Just a little guy. Hello there. <laughs> a little wormple. I don't think anyone actually calls you that except for you. For fear of being beat up by the rest of us. So I hatched a Togepi egg after a very, very long time, and out popped out a Pokemon. That was not this Pokemon. Well, it was this Pokemon, but it wasn't... Randomized evolutions, as well as randomized hatching and everything, led to this. I eventually ended up with this, so I'm like, oh, I'm fine with this. <laughs> at one point, it was a Why Not. Um, I don't remember what it was at first. Then it became Why Not, and now... Now it's this, so, yeah. Why not take a little chance? Gotta love randomizers and how silly they can get. Oh, 
It resists. Uh, maybe it's a water type. That's not good. That was exactly half my health. Man, I hope it's water type. It wasn't. But that should be enough to make me survive. Assuming it doesn't have a high damage range. Low kick. Of course. Of course. It went for the high part of the damage range. It's fine. Togepi may temporarily be a corpse, but it's fine. Uh, Dragon Rush. Maybe you're a dragon type. I always forget what Ninjask is in this. Wasn't, so I have no idea what it was. Wasn't a seal, wasn't a dragon, wasn't a water. Yeah, no, I'm not doing tail whip. My mother, as usual, calling at the most inopportune times. Alright, so let's go heal before we finish off this. I think that's what this is? Oh, I no, it's not this. Alright. I'm back from the ad break now. I think this was just... Yeah, no, that's what this was. So, two of my sisters are actually outside right now. That's wild. I was just in the restroom upstairs, and I just started hearing voices, and I'm like, pretty sure that's my oldest sister. And I listened a bit more, and I'm like, I'm pretty sure that's my middle sister, who is still older, but, you know. Just had to do a spin before she left. Yeah, silver. What's up, Krim? Rich girl Krim. I literally just fought one of these. I do not remember what it was weak to. Uh, I don't remember what I used against it. That's what I get for taking a three minute break. Alright, low kick. Uh, Shockwave. Get burned, gotta get burned. And finish off with another low kick. End up with more than half my HP, so not bad. I feel like I fought a Hypno before, and I have zero idea what it's weak to. So, let's figure it out. It's level 34, which kind of sucks. I resist that, you fool. Still got 32 damage. 
Because you're a poison type. Yep. Mayhaps I can crit you? Dang it. If one of them had crit, I would have beat him. Uh... I should be immune. Okay. Uh, Magnet Ball. I win! Skarmory's a dark type. So rather than even trying to get good XP, I'm just gonna swap over the one that I know can handle it. Low kick. You protected yourself, that's fair and valid. You knew what was coming. Ow. Really sucks that I got burned here. And that you're gonna be healing yourself constantly. I forgot this was your strat. Your dark type, which means that I can use anything but psychic on you. Do I have any other... Yeah, okay. Acupressure. Unlike you, I'm not gonna miss. Why exactly do you keep doing this to me? Okay. I really don't need more speed, I need defense. Please don't deal 8 damage. Okay, cool. Super Potion. Please. I need, you know, damage, defense, anything like that. Not whatever it is you're... trying to set up for this entire thing, but despite me highly upping my evasion at this point, it doesn't care. Just one more time. It should miss this time, right? Theoretically. Why wouldn't why wouldn't it hit? Alright. Acupressure. Either do evasion or defense or anything. Defense, there we go. You missed anyway. Heal myself once more. Because I don't remember if Santum is a special or physical. This should answer it. I believe it's physical. 
Alright. That's fine. I have no issue with that. I stop upping your speed. I don't need accuracy either. Let's go gambling! There we go, some attack up. This is very stupid, I know, but... Ev evasiveness, nice. I want to just kill everything. Magnet bomb. Now don't you dare burn me. Okay. Okay. Alright. It's fine. Why would I care? Draco Meteor. You're so annoying. I don't know what you are, so Magna Bomb. You missed. And now you're a ghost type. Which, honestly, you could have already been. Who knows? Blizzard. Seventy percent accuracy. Yeah, let's just do it. Wow, effect. Hey, hey, why so serious? Let me put a smile on that face. You know what? My accuracy's been raised twice. Blizzard. You gave me the power to do it. No way. Draco Meteor? So you're a steel type, got it. Morning sun, won't you come and wash away the pain? This hurts. Yep. Attack, Sharpway Rose. That's what I kind of need at this point. I should just swap. I know I should swap. I don't care. I want this thing dead. Keep on drinking water while I slowly, step by step, take this thing down. I'm gonna need a crit to kill this thing. I have that for it to run out of PP. Man, I hate you. Acupressure. Again. Because at this point, I kind of need the stat-ups. I didn't need defense. I needed attack or accuracy at this point. Stop giving me defense. Special attack. 
that's not going to do anything. Alright. If you want to hurt yourself, go for it. Blizzard. Yeah, of course, we both missed. I don't know why I tried that. <laughs> Get crit on. And that's the thing. You're out of Morning Sun. You're probably out of most things at this point. That was such a long battle. Why? Why do I lose? It's because you're mean. You're a mean person. Hey, Ethan. What's up? Ethan? Did you just tell me something you should have told me, like, at the beginning of the game? I'm, like, almost done with the Pokemon League. What's up? 